Well, with more people coming to Southwest Florida, some vulnerable wildlife is being threatened even more as their habitat shrinks. Animals like gopher tortoises. Fox 4's Anna Coles tells us how one couple decided to create a space for some unlikely neighbors. I don't have a neighbor now. I've got gopher tortoises for neighbors. Richard Alaperti wakes up most days to find gopher tortoises wandering on the land next door, sometimes seeing up to six to eight in a day. The tortoises live on land owned by Richard and his wife, Margaret, something that took them a while to get. Since I've lived here for about 14 years, I've been trying to buy the property next door and watch the tortoises develop. Um, and then one day, fortunately, it went up for sale. They quickly jumped on the opportunity to buy the land and name the lot after Margaret's late mother, Mary Jane, who loved the tortoises as much as they do. You know, to, in memory of her. She always enjoyed seeing the tortoises. And seeing the tortoises live in a safe environment is why they wanted to save the land for these guys. A lot of what we've grown up with disappears around us. To preserve that for the future generations is important. And to make that happen, Richard wants to work with scientists to find out more about their neighbors. To be able to track the tortoises, where they go, and be able to see how old they are, what they eat, um, where they travel, how they mate. Right now, there's over 40 burrows currently on the Alapertis lot, but they hope it keeps growing. Anna Coles, Fox 4, in York Horn.